Hi there. Welcome back to our video series of Applied Machine Learning with Kairos CV and Kairos NLP. My name is Wei, and I'm a developer advocate from Google ML team. Today, we're going to cover a very important topic, data augmentation. Kairos CV offers a wide suite of pre-processing layers implementing common data augmentation techniques and makes it easy to assemble state-of-the-art industry-grade data augmentation pipeline for image classification and object de detection tasks. To demonstrate how to perform data augmentation, let's first load up the Oxford Flower 102 dataset, which includes all kinds of flowers. We further pre-process the dataset here by shuffling and batching. Let's take a look at some sample flowers. They look beautiful. Now our data is ready and we can talk about data augmentation. Kairos CV offers a large number of data augmentation layers, but three of the most useful layers are probably random augment, cut mix, and mix up. These three layers are used in nearly all state-of-the-art image classification pipelines. So let me show you how they work. Random augment, as you can probably guess from the name, selects a random operation from a list of operations. Then it samples a random number if the number is smaller than the rate parameter, it will apply the random operation to the given image. Other than the rate parameter, the value range parameter specifies the range of values the images have. Augmentation per image specifies the number of operations to apply. Magnitude and magnitude STT dev basically determine the normal distribution used to sample for each data augmentation. You can see some sample results after applying random augment. Cut mix and mix up are the other two important operations. Cut mix randomly cuts out portions of one image and places them over another, and mix up interpolates the pixel values between two images. Feel free to learn more about them in the links below. On the right, you can also see the results after applying cut mix and mix up. Coming back to rand augment, while the default rand augment is pretty powerful, there may be some occasions where you want to customize it. For example, you want to exclude an augmentation or add another augmentation. In this case, you can use random augmentation pipeline. Random augmentation pipeline is a layer that works similarly to rand augment, but it gives you the flexibility to customize your augmentation pipeline. For example, here, we're removing the random rotation layer and adding the grid mask layer in the pipeline. Now we can apply the customized pipeline and use the result on the right. Here's another example of building a pipeline with grid mask and grayscale layers. Finally, let's train a convolutional neural network with augmentation as an exercise. We use cut mix, mix up, and random augment in this example. We use the efficient net v2 as a backbone and compile the model. Finally, we train the model. So to conclude, today we have learned how to augment image data with some of the most popular augmentation operations, random augment, cut mix, and mix up. They're built into Kairos CV and you can easily leverage them in your own use cases. You can also customize the augmentation pipelines to suit your own needs. With that, Thank you for watching this video. Please stay tuned for our next episode.